Ripley reporting successful jump procedure. Roger that. Begin field base setup. something near the LZ. It's closing in. Successful. Sensors online. Weapons activated. We're ready to go. Rift Breaker Novak, please report. Houston, this is Ashley. Reporting Rift Jump successful. Roger that. Begin field base setup. Ashley, construct a headquarters building to secure our presence here. It will allow me to reconstruct if my armor is destroyed. We don't have enough carbonium to build an HQ. Let's scout for a deposit and set up our base close to it. We need to move quick. It's probably a matter of time before the natives spot us. Okay, move on to the deposit and start drilling. We've gathered enough resources to construct a headquarters building. Finally. Let's place it close to a carbonium deposit. This will help us speed up resource production. HQ construction in progress. Sometimes I wish we could fast forward this part of the simulation. Captain Novak, let me remind you that even though this is a simulated training exercise, you are expected to perform as if it was your real mission on Galatea 37. We need to expand the base. Let's build a carbonium factory to do the digging for us. Yes, we've got much more interesting things to do. Let's automate this. amounts of power to operate. Right now, we can only construct some basic power plants, wind turbines, and carbonium power plants. 
Wind turbines are less effective, but they work around the clock. Carbonium power plants are very effective, but they use up the deposits that they are placed on. In the beginning, it's best to use a combination of these power sources. We can balance energy peaks and shortages by storing excess energy in energy storages. Also, remember to connect all buildings to the power grid using energy connectors. They connect all buildings within their area of operation, even if power lines are not visible. Ashley, remember to connect all buildings to the power grid. Energy connectors distribute power to all buildings within their operating radius. Detecting a lot of movement to the west. We should build up a defensive perimeter around the base. Let's set up some walls and sentinel towers. Focus our defenses on the western direction. They never change the beginning of this exercise. Captain Novak, we all know your renowned scientific background, but your combat performance in the previous simulation was far from spectacular. Slaughtering indigenous creatures was never my area of expertise. Since you've already done this a couple of times, we've introduced some new additions to this course. We'll see what your area of expertise really is. 